editorial in the Wall Street Journal today that says that numerous centrist and even left-leaning fact-checkers have said it's the president himself who's been misleading uh, on the issue of health care reform, specifically when it comes to providing money for abortions and the rationing of health care. Do you expect the president to address either of those issues tonight, in particular, uh, whether any public funds could go toward abortions tonight? The president has said repeatedly uh, that uh, federal funds uh, under law cannot be used to pay for abortions, and that will continue to be the case. I mean, uh, there is obviously uh, the, a market that would exist where uh, people can choose uh, the kind of health coverage they want, just as they can now. Mer Americans have choices in this country. This is about providing more choices for Americans, affordable choices, choices they don't have today because they can't afford coverage, they don't get coverage from work, or they're locked out of the insurance Understood. market because Mr. these Mr. insurance companies are discriminating I'm, I'm against them because they might have a pre-existing condition. I want to give you the chance to clarify. Because the the latest amendment of the House Bill uh, 3200 says that the, the, the plan that there will be no public plan. Let me let me restate that. That no plan would be forbidden from covering abortion-related services. That no plan would be forbidden from covering abortion-related services. That makes it sound well, for, sound like they, they will be covered or they could be. Uh, well, first of all, let's talk about you know what's going to emerge eventually. There are many pieces of this that are still being worked through. The president has made it clear that there will be choices for people of the kind of coverage they can receive, just as there is today, choice for people who want those services covered, who don't want those services covered. What he has also said is that uh, federal funds will not be used uh, to pay for abortions. That's the law, and that's not going to change. Well, that's, that's not exactly what the bill says. I guess we'll have to wait, as you point out, uh, to see what the president actually says about it tonight. But Linda Douglas, thank you so much for coming on. Thank you, Megan.